the, they don't have clients because even the crypto fans, the Bitcoin fans, stop using Bitcoin to pay them. Eh? Yes. And that's the situation today. So, 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 that's that's possibly the low hanging fruit here. Eh? Uh, a lot of already existing merchants that accept crypto, but yeah, not many payments come in. So, and and these users are familiar already with Bitcoin, but they don't want to pay with it. The Byteball cashback program may really inspire them to start using crypto again with their merchants. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. That's the point. We want yeah. to be a, a, a currency, mm -hmm, uh, mm -hmm. something that users use uh, every day, mm -hmm. um, just as a means of payment. Mm -hmm. And in the first place, uh, not not just simple payments, but payments. Uh, that are bound to conditions, conditional payments that are only possible or in crypto. But you can't make conditional payments in in fiat currency. Okay, but but um, and do, like like what is that? Because this is I I, I agree that, that that's true what you say. But um, how how does where is that market? Where is that doesn't exist yet or or, or like. And is that related to the cashback program or not? Uh, no, it's uh, oh. it's not directly related no. to the cashback program. No. Uh, it's uh, something that unique to crypto uh, that you can uh, have a smart contracts <laughs> on the on the distributed ledger, and you can actually link several events uh, so that. One event happens only after another event mm -hmm. uh, with the help of smart contracts. Mm -hmm. And for example, you can have uh, can do uh, insurance. What that's what I'm going to talk about tomorrow. Mm -hmm. uh, you can uh, make simple, very simple insurance contracts. Mm -hmm. Uh, that are resolved automatically mm -hmm. by uh, uh, by conditions, by events that uh, happen in the outside world and mm -hmm. that are brought into the uh, distributed nature by uh, oracles. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, and you can do it without trust uh, to the other party. Mm -hmm. uh, which means that the platform as a whole, uh, it, uh, it enables trust. It allows you to trust somebody who you don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, that's uh, the big, big thing about crypto. Mm -hmm. uh, and it allows you, uh, it allows new businesses that are small, that don't have any reputation to, uh, to to start uh, selling their products mm -hmm. uh, and this is a more competitive market. Mm -hmm. It is a more open market where you can have uh, many offers, mm -hmm. uh, many uh, players who are uh, more agile, they're, they're small, they're quick uh, mm -hmm. to adapt to changing conditions, mm -hmm. uh, they're creative. Uh, compared to uh, big established companies mm -hmm. uh, who are uh, yeah. quite slow to uh, introduce new things. Yes. Well, well uh, to me, it, well, I, I think um, the audience will agree, uh, but uh, to me, you look like you're, you're a genius. Really. I'm very impressed. It's really cool. I'm very happy to pump all my money into Byteball. <laughs> no, not all, but uh, a, a nice piece because, yeah, I think it's, uh, yeah, I really like that when the way you do that, like, you, it's, a, it's a slogan of Byteball also, it's smart payments and private transactions. The smart payments, yeah, you're right, I mean, you have to, I, for me, I'm like focused on, on, on uh, I want to see cryptocurrency adopted in, in stores, but it's a bit naive. Um, new tech 
It will only be really adopted where it's offering, where it's really using its new possibilities. Eh? And so you're very smart to focus on that eh? and to really try to um, offer things that you can't do with normal money. So yeah, I think that's really great and I should put some more thinking into that myself. But at the same time, we're also targeting the traditional payments market also eh? with, this, with the cashback program. Yeah. Yes, yes, we're going to try to involve more people mm -hmm. uh, to get them to know about it in, mm -hmm. in the first place. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, but at the end of the day, uh, there are advantages of crypto that uh, on, there are things that only crypto can do, such as mm -hmm. conditional payments, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and uh, this is something that that is new, mm -hmm. that enables uh, a new business, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, it is, uh, the main thing mm -hmm. it is it enables creation of value in uh, various economic uh, mm -hmm. activities mm -hmm. uh, and. That's what we are bringing to the world uh, mm -hmm. with this uh, environment mm -hmm. that uh, allows to uh, uh, make secure transactions without uh, knowing the counterpart. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's uh, it's uh, it's super. So, so, what's your dream with Biteball? Where where would you like to see it? And also, like. How is it going for you? Where is Biteball is today? Is this what you had envisioned two years ago when you were working on it, just on your own? Uh, well, with, what we have today is just the beginning. Uh, what we uh, was the dream, dream, it is uh, to be used for uh, in, in everyday transactions, in, in contracts. Just to be in an environment where where safe contracts are created and enforced, uh, and uh, be chosen for for simplicity, for security uh, that is provided by by the platform. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, and. Um... What do you think of the valuation today of Byte Ball, of Bytes and Black Bytes? Uh, well, I'm not the person to ask about valuations. Uh, I really don't know about uh, what's the fair price. Well, unlike other cryptocurrencies, we have a very clear uh, Pricing model, if I can call it, uh, of bytes. One byte allows you to store uh, data. One byte, the currency. Uh, uh, one byte of currency allows you to store one byte of data uh, in the distributed ledger permanently. Yeah, yeah. And this data is not just just data from family photos. It is transactional data that secures your money, the transactions. Um, so um, just ask how, how much you are ready to pay for securing your transactions. Uh, and depending on demand on uh, this uh, service uh, provided by the, the network, uh, uh, this is what just determines the price of bike. Yeah. Well, you just went a few steps further than my comprehension uh, <laughs> can follow, but I can. I, I find it so beautiful the way you created that bytes, the names, eh, like kilobytes, megabytes, gigabytes, and. Um, and, uh, uh, and it's just very, very, very smart, the, the way you've done that. Um, it really fits with the idea of uh, internet money. Uh, um, uh, it's very smart to, to immediately give, give, give such a, a structure to bundle 
large quantities uh, into different names. Bitcoin really struggles with that. Eh? Um, Bitcoin is, is, is everybody's looking at the price of one Bitcoin and, and nobody can afford one Bitcoin <laughs> anymore today. And, and so people simply because of that uh, want to have other coins. Eh? Uh, so you totally avoided that uh, with the bytes and very smart to, to, to have bytes as a standard unit and then these largest units and so familiar with the computer world. It's, 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 it's exactly the same uh, structure. So I think it's very beautiful. Uh, storing the, the one uh, that one byte you can buy one byte of storage mm, that's one step further than my comprehension but uh, I, I can see that it is also something beautiful I just don't understand it fully huh? but to me to you that's like this is the real value of a byte it's what you can buy with it in the dark huh? yes yes you you write your, your contract your contract is dependent on its, its complex, com, complexity. It takes some space, say two kilobytes, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, you know that this contract guarantees that uh, it will be executed as you like. Uh, the other party uh, uh, will pay or will provide the service that you actually expect from them, mm -hmm. and. Uh, and you pay this amount of bytes for securing your contract. Uh, you decide what's the fair, fair price for it. Mm -hmm. Alternatively, you could uh, make a contract in a traditional way mm -hmm. uh, and uh, be uh, and expect that if the other party doesn't uh, execute the part of the contract, mm -hmm. uh, you will use the legal system to sue them. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, that's the other way. Mm -hmm. Now you have an alternative. Mm -hmm. oh, very interesting, very interesting. Yeah, so um, we are at 52 minutes. What else should we talk about that's important for the people to know about Biteball? Uh, well, I guess I said uh, already too much what? <laughs> important uh, thing about Biteball and... Um, oh yeah, of course, uh, people always ask and, and I agree, like decentralization of the witnesses is very important. Eh? So I understand that you want people that are uh, trustworthy, eh? um, but, but is it also the case that you basically want this process also to be decentralized like people should like the end users should really like start selecting other witnesses than you is this what you expect to happen uh, no it's not realistic that end users will be so so active to mm -hmm, select mm -hmm. uh, uh, the witnesses mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, I really want uh, to involve uh, uh, known trusted uh, um, users, businesses mm -hmm. to be witnesses, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, I expect that uh, some users who are more active will be uh, watching uh, uh, their activity and uh, their opinion will be important for end users when they select uh, the witnesses and, and uh, mostly um, end users will follow as they usually do uh, uh, their opinion leaders uh, and uh, we just want to have uh, a good choice of uh, uh, trusted business and businesses and uh, users uh, for, for, for this role. Yes, 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 yes. And uh, so, yeah, that will happen over time. Probably, yes. huh? Yeah. Cool. So, um, yeah, I think we can uh, end it. Eh? Uh, or is there something else we should uh, we should? Uh, 
say, well, I just want to congratulate you. I think you did an absolute amazing job. And I, yeah, yeah, really. And thank you um, for just uh, being there and creating this and, 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 and pushing it. And uh, it's really, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm very happy. I can invest in it. And also very happy that people have been dumping uh, bite ball to the floor. I was very happy to buy them uh, considerably cheaper in the past few months than uh, they've been a uh, couple months back. Eh? Um, yeah, so yeah, thanks so much. Thank you. <laughs>